was put in a place for not minding her own business. Take a look. Now you say I can't drive and do what now? You got what right to tell me what now? You can't cross. I can't I cross what? Says solid who? Line. What what job do you have? Are you a police officer? Are you a lawmaker? No. All right then, so get your hand on the street and go about your business. That was a good one. Imagine this Karen trying to be a police officer. Unbelievable. You won't believe what this guy did. Make sure to watch till the end. Take a look. <coughs> yes, uh, I've got an intruder here at, at my apartment. Can you come take care of him? Uh, what, what did you say? 37th Avenue. Here in Hattiesburg, Mississippi. Get my MacBook. Yeah, right. I don't know. North 32nd Avenue. Um, it's a uh, Southern Court. It's probably like eight in the morning, ain't it? Okay, it's immediately behind McDonald's. Oh, uh, boy. It's gonna be great. It's great. It's great. It's great. It's great. Black, everything black is on me. Everything black is on me, huh? Everything black. Everything black. Did he have dinner? Everything black. No. No, he's not breaking into my home. He's coming into my apartment. Yep, yep. Go ahead, tell him. I'm not bringing it to your home, but I'm coming to your apartment. That don't make no sense. Yeah. Not breaking to your home, but coming to your apartment. That make no sense. My name is Charles Sutton. Right here, right here next to, next to Southern Miss, bro. Uh, 601-807-2767. And you're saying he's saying to you? Yeah, ma'am. Get my MacBook, because I'm, I'm a DJ, bro. DJ K Crazy. I'm out here doing music. This guy want to come up to me here and mess with me, because it's 8 in the morning. I'm going to do some DJ work. He wants to come mess with me. Literally, he works with me. That's why he's here. We work together. Yep. Same job. Yeah, tell him, Dank. Yeah. So he was in there staying with you. He, he's not staying here. He's not staying with me. He's here with me. He's hanging out in the apartment because we're doing something on his MacBook that we needed to do. So that's why he came out here to get his MacBook. Just go ahead and tell him, man. We just doing work, man. That's, that's all. That's the letter. We do music. We do music here, bro. You videoing me, mister? Yes, sir. Just okay. make sure I'm safe. I can. Why don't you get, get out of here? Huh? Y'all see this? Y'all see this? You better back up, sir. Back, I'll tell back you up, what. sir. I'm a young man, bro. You, you, you too old for this. Uh, I may be. You way too old for this. You you would know you. You stay you stay in an apartment right next to right next to right next to a college. Right next to a college, man. It's over there. Okay, we're gonna wait and see what the police have said. Okay. Oh, I got the video. Okay, that's we good. gonna wait for the police. Yeah, we gonna wait for that. Thank you. 
about to be here right. I'm I'm recording, and as soon as they get here. No, I didn't ask you that. I said, who else have you got in your apartment? Why you gotta worry about all that, man? Who stayed all? Who stayed in your apartment? Who stayed in your apartment? It's cause we black, ain't it? If we were some pretty white girls, you wouldn't say We'd probably be going to campus right now, going to school, huh? Ain't that right? You always put up with this thing? If I was a pretty white girl with my Mac, I'd probably be going to school. Right over there. But now nah, I'm 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 black. Yeah. So he 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 wanna he he he, he wanna come mess with me, huh? He wanna come mess with me. Yeah, come on. Yeah, hit my hand with a power drill. This man think I'm a screwdriver. I'm making jokes. I can't wait till they get here. Shirt tucked in at this time of morning, bro. take your walk with that power drill. Oh, glad. Who you calling? Who you calling? Hey, man, I'm, re I, I'm, I'm recording this dude, bro. This man. That man right there attacked my phone, bro. On, on some race shit. This time of morning, bro. Morning sign, and I look at him. I man, hi, hi, my truck. Bring your ugly here, boy. Come here, bring your goof. No ugly goofs. Look at him, about to go straight back in that apartment. Ugly. I'm on it. Oh, big glasses. Gonna go wake up, drink some coffee. Oh, glad. That's just true. Huh? That's his truck right there. Oh, I'm about to get his tag. Roddy got some good dudes today. This separado is nice, too. Ooh, we. Ooh, we. Look where racism do. Mm. Look at that. PJ2. Some people are just very difficult to deal with. How can this guy here threaten to call the cops and the cops never showed up? Also, he was acting as if he is the owner of the apartment building. Unbelievable. HOA Karen in the wild. Take a look at this drama. Hey, what are you doing there? Hey. Yes. Yes. Why? Why are you taking pictures of my car? Um, I'm with the HOA, and yeah. unlicensed car is not allowed to be parked in the driveway. It has to be in the garage, or. Right. For it could be covered with a uh, car cover. Okay. So I just wanted and, to... And, like, and your name is what? Ashley. Eager. And I left you some Charwell information. Correct. And um, so there's some information there. You can go online and sign the documents that say that. And then also I need to let you know the pool code because I didn't write it in there. Okay. Cool. I've got the I've got the cool code, and and so the house is owned by Mike Bagwell. He's the yeah. one that maintains the HOA. So you can contact Mike. Okay. And uh, I you know appreciate you not creeping around my house. Uh, well, you know I tried to come and knock on your door, so yeah. just letting you know. And then take a picture of my tag, and I will. So not submit the tag number, but. I will have to submit the um, expiration. Okay. Well, I, I thought you guys did all that stuff from the curb and weren't um, coming onto people's property. Well, it's pretty obvious that you backed the car in. So. 
Well, actually, that's how they dropped it off when I asked them to tow it. So, um, okay, well, do you have a do you have a job? Yeah, uh, yes, I work from home. Okay. Cool. All right. Well, uh, thanks for letting me know. Okay. Thank you. Huh? How would you have responded to this HOA Karen if you were the homeowner that was confronted by her? Let me know your thoughts in the comment section. Karen gets put in a place by another customer for disrespecting fast food restaurant workers. Take a look. I'm so tired of, of, of ignorant people like you coming in here talking bad about the workers. That's why you can't get workers. Who wants to sit here and, and listen to someone here and talk? Let that man work. That man talk to me like, I want you to join the bed with me. It doesn't matter what I like. I can tell you don't like it. Well, too bad. Go someplace else. Go to Burger King. How did you wait? How did you wait, Burger King? We can shut the up. I just said that. I said shut the up. I don't care who you call. I could care less. Excuse me. Can you call the police? You call them. Yes, you can. You call me. Well, then get the man at the back of the room. Can I call that corner ground? No, it's good. Kudos to that customer for standing up for those workers. Take a look at this Karen's reaction after she was called out for hitting someone else's parked car. Watch this. Anything? So you never so you never hit it? You never hit the car? I said it tapped your wheel. It did not tap the wheel. That's why you got out the car. You, you wouldn't be standing here with me if you did I not. I got out of the car what because are you yelling I'm for? to What are you mall. yelling for? I'm not yelling at you. I got out of the car because I parked so it how, so I can go so, inside. So how would you feel if I hit your car door and act like I didn't hit it? How would you feel? I'm not acting like I didn't okay, hit it. Okay, so I'm asking you. I'm asking you. I've had it happen to me. Okay. And so how do you feel? How does it make you feel? It doesn't feel good. It doesn't feel good. Right. So I'm asking you to just be reasonable. You're acting as if it never happened. No, I said it didn't. I did not say it didn't happen. Okay. So what would you like to do, ma'am? I don't think there's anything to do. What are you planning on doing? This is my thing. It, it will be ruined. I'm sorry that I okay. tapped it accidentally. Okay. I would just. My I, foot got caught. Listen, I understand we are all human and things happen. I'm not mad at you. I just don't like when people try to flip the script. That's where I'm going with this, okay? So all I'm saying is in the future, in the future, just be mindful of how close you are and be mindful when you open your door that there is a possibility that you can hit someone's car. And then when you hit it, don't be so jumpy when they react i'm reacting in the nicest way possible i'm just reacting in a nice way but i don't think you would react this way if it were the shoe on the other foot that's all i'm saying well i disagree with you on that okay you want me to hit your car door and see how you feel well oh, i just want to see how you feel let me let me just hit your door real quick and see how you feel about it wow did you all notice how karen became so quiet when the lady told her, let me hit your own car so that you would know how it feels. Unbelievable. Finally, for this video, what would you do if you have a Karen as your neighbor? Watch this. I am glad you are taking a picture. Otherwise, people will not know what kind of a person are you. You are a stupid, bad person, bad neighbor, bad person.
not excuse you. Excuse me! No. No. I will not allow no. you to no. trespass. I have been given you notices. Okay. Do not trespass. Go to the, I will not the allow police you and the court. To trespass. Go to the police and to the court. Okay, I go to the police. No, and you go. No, you, you, no, you, you have been lying all along. That I have done this and that. You I will not leave allow you. Don't touch me. I will not touch you. Actually, I am going to yes. take this. Yes, take your picture and I will not allow you to trespass in my lawn. I don't know about you, but I would probably relocate. But let me know what you think in the comment section.